welcome to North American Trapper today. We're actually going to give you some homeowner solutions today. We're going to show you how to use the Duke cage traps to your advantage. And we're going to show you a couple different situations. It doesn't matter if you're a, a farmer, a rancher, a homeowner, uh, a hunter. These Duke cage traps can be used anywhere. Put your bait in. We, we, you know, we do a couple little different things you're gonna see. We hang a ball down and get our magnet all over it. And you wouldn't even really need to do that. That's just one thing that I like to add. But uh, you're gonna see those methods and techniques in this show and you can use them anywhere across the country. And I'm a firm believer that every homeowner, every rancher, every farmer, doesn't matter anywhere across the board you should have a cage trap for raccoons possums skunks groundhogs squirrels chipmunks because you're going to have those problems whether you live in the country or you live in the city so we're going to get into that right now what i'm going to do is bring it right out here to where when this door comes up you're going to see that That's going to catch their attention, and we're going to give a little trailing scent, but right back here is where our ball is going to go. Now, this is our, our ball again that we're using um, in our cage traps, and we're going to soak that with our magnet trailing scent. Now, as you can see, I'm going to do it right here in front of the cage so that that comes in this way. I don't want a lot of scent out here and whatever. I want them to hit that and then work in. So we'll just take that in through, and as you can see, any wind blows, that's going to move. And that's exactly what we want. Um, the only thing else that I'm going to do is put a little of our coon buster bait in there. And I'm going to get it back here. I'm not going to put it around and, and things of that nature. I want them to smell that. I want them to smell that uh, crawfish scent coming out of here and knowing that they have to go in through this cage to get to it. So we're just going to dump some of that right down through the screen to where it's only in the trap. And I can actually smell the, the crawfish coming out of this. Man, that's good. But they're going to smell that too. And, and ultimately, that's all you have to do if you're a homeowner, rancher, trapper, whatever. These cage traps work great. Uh, I don't, like I said, put bait around to, to get them in there because... If you do have something that, uh, if you're using a different bait or whatever bait you're using, if they have something that they taste and they're like, nah, I don't want it, they're going to be moving away. If they don't like your bait and you have it in the back, they don't taste it until they've already set the trap off. I'll show you some other things where we're catching uh, skunks and coons for homeowners. But ultimately, we got our ball here that's got our trailing scent on it. And uh, as I said, all I do is just pour that I can even pour a little more on there and it soaks right into into that uh, white styrofoam ball and that just hangs there that's a sweet flavor going out through there we also have the crawfish scent going out through there and if there's any coons or skunks that come by here we're gonna have them when we come in tomorrow but uh, make sure you uh, get a few of these and they're gonna help you around your house on your farm or on your ranch uh, control your predators and your your ground nesting uh, birds will thrive a little bit more. The Trapper of the Week is Jordan McGinnis with his filled bobcat tag from Illinois taken in a dirt hole on a two-track. Congratulations, Jordan! And get your chance to be Trapper of the Week by visiting us at NorthAmericanTrapper.com. Handling nest graders is our specialty, and you can become the steward of your own land with our North American Trapper Scent Package, which includes our Coon Buster DP bait and magnet trailing scent. Our sweet scented trailer will draw them in where our Coon Buster will then take over, and its soaked crawfish essence will entice those nest graders to work the trap consistently. Look no further than our North American Trapper Combo Scent Package for all your predation control needs. North American Trapper. Proven products. Proven conservation. Welcome back to Duke Trap's presentation of North American Trapper with Alan Probst. Well, I'm here with Craig Rear, rather, and he actually is the rancher that we're on his property here, and we appreciate you giving us uh, the opportunity, and actually you got a hold of Thad and said, come on over and, 
catch some of these coons and I kind of wanted to give you an opportunity to talk about you know how these coons and raccoons and skunks and things can can really hurt you as a rancher even though you're not I know you have some cornfields and plants and stuff but you're more of a, a rancher and you got a lot of really good uh, cattle here but I want to give you an opportunity to kind of talk about how they affect you even as a rancher you know we we deal with with them especially with the farm and the corn they'll knock acres down they you know deer do a lot of damage and we have a major deer problem here as well and you know, just the overpopulation and now we're getting sick deer sick coon and uh where you know it makes us a little nervous around the livestock rabies and such with the coon especially absolutely and, and our our dogs and cats and everything else. you know we love the wildlife but the problem, problem we've had and we're seeing everywhere is the population is getting out of control and all these animals are sick because of it so and that you know, gives us the opportunity to use trapping as a viable method you know, to help you out it's a it's a necessary part of of what we do and there's not a lot of money in it for people so we need to we need to deal with that in a way that you know whether it's state government or stock growers whatever it happens to be we need some somebody to back this thing to be able to you know to, to lessen our competition but you know keep a healthy balance here so absolutely yeah well we definitely appreciate yeah. the opportunity to get in here yeah. and hopefully uh, we can continue to take a few more of them out of the equation for well, you i appreciate it well here's one of those situations as a homeowner or a rancher or a farmer you can help yourself out in the background here as you can see we have a skunk in a cage trap we're out here on this ranch. Uh, he's got a really nice barn down here. He's got horses. And when he's putting out his horse feet and stuff, the raccoons, the skunks, everything is getting into it. And, and he called us and said, hey, come on over here and, and, and see if you can help me out. And he actually had a couple. We're usually using the Duke cage traps. He actually had a couple old ones. I said, well, we'll just use your traps. And then we'll, we'll make it a whole uh, thing where we're using all of your stuff on your property. We got ourselves a pretty nice skunk here and um, we'll uh, take care of him back in the first shed but ultimately uh, we got this reset here we got our coon buster down here on the pan any skunk or coon that works in there now we're gonna get ourselves another one and hopefully uh, uh, we continue to take some of these predators and and uh, feed eaters out of his population over here on this nice ranch well we got us another big skunk here on this ranch uh, Oh boy, that's a big old skunk right there, boy. He's got two nice white stripes. One thing when you're dealing with these skunks, you just want to, I mean, we're talking right now, but when you're by yourself, you can really just kind of work around them and just watch that tail. That's a really nice skunk. Uh, you know, you put these cage traps in, uh, have something in there that entices them down into the, the trap, and you're going to catch these animals and get them out of your populations uh, around your house uh, they can be a nuisance they can get under your porch your barn your shed uh, as I mentioned earlier they're, they're gonna cause some issues with your pets possibly um, skunks are actually really uh, notorious for digging in yards also looking for grubs digging holes uh, so your whole front yard looks like it's been aerated like a golf course but ultimately getting these uh, animals out of the population is is what we're trying to do and the homeowner uh can sleep a little easier tonight but we'll get this skunk taken care of uh we'll get this trap back in there but it's a beautiful day uh if you're using these methods uh around your house or, or your farm or your uh, uh ranch you're gonna you see his tail go up there i'm gonna back off just a hair but ultimately um you can get these uh problem animals out of your equation and, and make life a little bit easier for you. Well, we got a double. Just got that one out up here, and we got another one right here. This is uh, another skunk, that's three now, in two checks. Uh, this set had one the other day. Stay down here, I'm actually downwind, so I hope he doesn't fly at me, but ultimately, right here on this ranch, and uh, as I said, the landowner's having some serious problems with, with skunks through here. They're, they're getting under his porch. They're digging. Uh, he's got dogs and pets, and he doesn't want to have any issues with them. And, and we're in here, and then ultimately we got uh, three skunks now and two checks, and I'm sure we're going to get more. But 
you know, this road right here just is a travel way from the barn to the house and ultimately uh, those skunks and raccoons and everything are working up through here every night and uh, as you can see these box traps really help you. Now it's time for the North American Trapper Tip of the Week. I'll show you a couple of the products that we use for our fur handling needs. Uh, we use a lot of the weedy products. Um, you have your pelters, scrapers, things of that nature here, uh, tail stripper, beaver knife, soft-handed knives, red fox, vixen. Um, these are a really, really sharp knife, but they are just a fantastic skinner. Uh, for all you ranchers and farmers out there and guys that are out in the field a lot, though, they all come with uh, a handy pouch for your belt. And as you know, when you're out in the field, you really need a sharp knife sometimes when you're dealing with uh, a lot of the duties that you have out there. But along with that, if you're looking to do any fur handling for market or for uh, tanning, fur, home decor, anything of that nature, check out the Weeby line. I think you're going to be very happy with it. Um, they have something that can fit all budgets and something that's going to pretty much handle all your needs as a fur handler. North American Trapper Predation Packages. Get any one of our specific trapping packages that has been ultimately designed to help you become the master predation controller of your farm, ranch, or hunting lease. Control the predators that are costing you time and money and get out there trapping today with one of our North American Trapper Predation Boxes. All of the packages come with the trapping essentials to get you out in the field, plus an instructional DVD that will show you the way. Visit us at NorthAmericanTrapper.com and start breaking dirt today. Welcome back to Duke Trap's presentation of North American Trapper with Alan Probst. Three more nice coons here. I can't wait to see the stealth cam 4K footage of what maybe transpired here like we did the last time we were in here. Had one in the cage trap, two in the DPs on each side. It's just an unbelievable location here. This farmer's got this junk pile. I fully expected to have more skunks than coons here, but we've uh, been pounding the coons, and I, like I said, can't wait to see that Stealth Cam 4K coverage. Uh, we showed you the other day, but on this pond up here where we had a double, we got another double there today as well, so uh, we're putting up a lot of good, uh, good numbers. Uh, I'm really happy with what is transpiring with both of my baits, the Reaper and the Coon Buster, um, using the trailing set the magnet with it it's just you know you can just see it they're, they're just following it right into the cage trap nose to the ground and uh it's really really putting up some uh good fur for us um here doing this predation stuff and like i said earlier we're helping out the farmers the ranchers we're helping out those ground nesting birds and anybody out there on your land you can do this whether you have two traps one trap half a dozen or a hundred you can go out there put these in the ground take a few of these predators out of the equation and you're going to help your ground nesting birds as well but i couldn't be any happier we're going to get these three out of here i got these three reset and we're going to go home and see what we got on this stealth cam because i fully expect it to be pretty good we at North American Trapper understand the importance of getting youth involved in the tradition of trapping. Go to NorthAmericanTrapper.com forward slash give and purchase your bait or trap. We'll duplicate your purchase to your local state organization and get a youth involved in the art of trapping. I wanted to take a little minute here and talk to Ross Pittman. He's the cob father. Uh, he's the one that uh, runs all these uh, fields, owns the fields and the corn fields. And I just kind of, we're out here doing depredation um you've been gracious enough to let us come in here and trap and and you know hopefully we're doing you a service and we can get some animals for you but i kind of wanted you to tell the viewer out there how these raccoons not only are they ground nesting predators and things like that but the damage and the financial uh, instability that they can cause people like you in farming situations especially when you have as much corn as you do down here along these river bottoms the uh outside of the field as soon as the corn reaches that sweet corn stage then the state's livestock likes to move in and in certain places like close to building sites like these they can really dig out into a field a put a number on it yeah, i know you can go from down in the single digits on the yield monitor when you go through with the combine and 
can be a 250 bushel corn out in the middle of the field where the untouched trapping is definitely my biggest way of getting rid of coons but I have some friends that come out in the winter time to that infrared on coyotes at night and they'll see all kinds of coons out here they're just everywhere for everybody out there the predation methods and the techniques that we're showing you on this show are not only helping you know farmers out like Ross here, but they can help you as a homeowner with your own garden. They can help you as a rancher protecting your livestock, whether it's chickens and things of that nature. It's going to help against ground nesting birds, uh, keeping you know some of them more, and ultimately we appreciate the opportunity to get out here, and uh, you know we'll definitely be coming back here every time you allow us to do that. We, uh, we made this set yesterday, actually we made this set and filmed the making this particular set where these coons run in and out of this old homestead here. Um, very simply, we got our magnet sitting on this uh, white ball in the back that entices them in. Uh, we had a little bit of our coon buster in there and this one uh, came in and worked it. But um, this is a, a, just a testimony to the to the Duke cage trap, it's it's a really good tool, especially for you homeowners out there. I mean, we're over here on a farm right now doing some depredation for him, but if you own a house out there or you're having some issues where animals are getting under your, your house or your garage or whatever, groundhogs, skunks, possums, raccoons, foxes, if you're having problems with chickens, um, you know, animals getting your chickens, whether it's foxes or things like that. These cage traps can catch these animals for you so you can get them off your property and continue to uh, move forward with that. But ultimately, uh, I told you before, they have this protective plate where I can now pick that animal up. I can take this animal anywhere I want to go now. If I want to go release them, I can do that. Or if I you know, want to dispatch them, uh, I can do that as well. But you can see that's a, uh, a good device, a good safety device for you there. Um, but ultimately, we're going to get this raccoon taken care of, and uh, as you can see, we're getting it done with the Duke cage trap, and you can too, uh, and it's just really awesome to be out here. Let's take a look at the North American Trapper Product Spotlight. Well, this week on the Product Spotlight, I wanted to talk to you about our ground talons. And this is the heavy duty that I have uh, connected to my Duke 550s, but we have them that come in the standard and then also the heavy duty. Now, they can go on the bottom of a DP. You can attach those. They're going to work for you in any situation across country. Uh, I'd use the standard for when I'm out there coon trapping, muskrat, mink, if I need a possibly an upper anchor for beaver. The heavy duty we're going to use for our canine sets, the five Fox, coyote, bobcat, things of that nature, but uh, we sell them by the dozen, five dozen, ten dozen. Um, they are a fantastic item. They're going to work for you. You know when you put your set in the ground, if one of these are in the ground, it's going to hold them and they're going to be there when you come in. So ultimately, uh, if you get on the website, check out our ground talons. I'm sure you're going to be happy with what you find. You need to have faith in the baits and lures piquing the curiosity of those at large predators. North American Trapper has you covered on your quest with our skunk-based madness, crawfish-based coon buster, fish-based reaper, and our meat-based mountain man. North American Trapper baits and lures are all multi-layered and proven to help you become the best predation trapper that you can be. Take back control of the ecosystem that is yours and get our scent bundle at NorthAmericanTrapper.com for the next time you're out breaking dirt on the line. Welcome back to Duke Trap's presentation of North American Trapper with Alan Probst. As you can see, the weather has just turned. This is the third check, third raccoon in this cage trap. You can see how awesome these things work. I mean, he's got that all tore up though, but uh, this is the third uh, coon that we've gotten in this cage trap right here by this junk pile if you uh, need something for your house or your farm or wherever where you don't want to put the, the DPs or something else these Duke cage traps are gonna work great for you as we showed you we have the bait door here the handle you can carry them and transport them into different areas but ultimately uh, if you get them set 
those coons are going to work back in there and you're going to be able to get those problem animals off of your property so uh we're going to take him and get him taken care of and probably pull this up today and come back we're supposed to get about blizzards coming through we're supposed to get about five to eight inches in about a six to seven hour period and you can see the wind's blowing and it's it's cold it's probably about 20 degrees but the wind's blowing it's probably down around zero but uh anytime you have these situations around your house your farm your ranch put these duke cage traps in and they're going to work great for you to uh take care of these animals and uh solve a lot of your problems so we'll get this one taken care of and move on down the road well i hope you enjoyed that today uh, as you can see the duke cage traps are going to work for you pretty much any situation out there chasing these coons now it doesn't matter if it's raccoons uh, you're going to see over time in the show we're going to show you chipmunks squirrels we're going to show you groundhogs rabbits we're going to show you a lot of these different scenarios where all of these cage traps work for you whether you're a homeowner a rancher a farmer you're going to have problems with animals that are that are causing you havoc whether it's damage to your house crop damage it doesn't matter you're going to have problems whether you live in the country or you live in the city and i'm a firm believer everybody should definitely have at least one or two of these duke cage traps but if you want to check them out you can go to our website northamericantrapper.com we have those and a lot of different products that are going to help you when you go out in the field proven products equals proven conservation and we'll see you next time on north american trapper